just making a quick video on how to use it flyover country I'm using it opening it um, no thanks you can use it in airplane mode and with GPS on the location but right now I'm still using it in non airplane mode I'll tell you why create a path then look for maps landscape features I don't think we all we need all these right but yeah you can check or uncheck what you want or what you don't but a lot of these mean it'll take that much time for downloading so I think the science nuggets thing is I you know like articles and they take a lot of time to download so I'm, 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 I'm just taking three geological maps uh, landscape features and hollow scene vol volcanoes and then search for places here you will input Phoenix Arizona and then SFO create path this is your path and then you are able to download a offline version it's been years I've used this app so might change a little bit now uh, but yeah you can save Let's see how long it takes. Oh, 300 articles with just geologic maps, landscape features, and hollow scene volcanoes. Oh my god, that's a lot of articles. If we have checked everything up, uh, then it would have been a huge uh, data but right now it's only 3.2 mb it shows right here uh, it's 3.2 mb that it needs it's a very interesting application i like it a lot okay uh, you know let it finish and i'll continue took a little bit uh, took a little bit of while um, path saved okay now I think you just go to save paths and then load and then it will load and then when you're when you're moving you can click on the GPS and then it'll show where you are so that's how you use it I just saw on YouTube that it is um, not many tutorials that that um, help uh, with this app so I just made one enjoy your trip